All of this may look intimidating, but this machine could find lung cancer that you don't even know you have. This is a CT scanner and you know, you've probably heard of a CAT scan. That's what this is. It's used for many different things, but we now have a capability to do a low dose lung screening CT, um, which we've been doing here at East Jefferson Hospital. And what that enables us to do is to catch lung cancers before they're large, when they can be identified, treated, and essentially cured. Who is a candidate for this? Lung cancer screening is best targeted at those individuals that are former smokers or that have quit within the last 15 years. But there are also other individuals that may benefit if you're at high risk for lung cancer. If you have had a previous lung cancer, you can even benefit from screening. The scan takes, from the time you're on the table, no more than two minutes, and the dose that you get is so low, you'd get a similar dose of radiation just standing outside for a year. It's very safe from a radiation standpoint, and we're finding cancer early. Cancer is not good anywhere in the body, but the smaller the cancer, the better chance we have of treating it in such a way that it never comes back. This is the cutting edge, basically, of lung cancer screening. When I was in residency, I was learning about low-dose lung cancer screening CT, and the first one that I actually read that had a cancer, I remember reading that case and finding a mass in this patient's lung, and that patient went on to have a biopsy that showed that they had lung cancer. It hadn't spread yet, and the patient got surgery appropriately for it and that patient ended up living, surviving. And I had the pleasure of actually talking to this patient on the phone and hearing about his gratitude. That to me, I think, was the moment that really made me passionate about this whole area of radiology and medicine. Quick, easy, painless, and it could save your life. I'm Camille Whitworth. Thanks for watching.